When we started this trip, we never thought it would end like this. Hey, I'm Mike with the Florida Public Archaeology Network. Today we are at the Weeks Bay National Estuary Research Reserve learning all about freshwater systems and wetlands as part of the Florida Master Nationals program. Our morning began with a boat ride up the Fish River. Brown pelicans, egrets, bald eagles, and ospreys gave us a show along the way. Eventually, the captain pointed the stern into Weeks Bay, and after passing some fishermen, we entered Mobile Bay. These estuaries are where fresh water from the rivers meets the salt water from the Gulf of Mexico. We learned that 90% of marine animals spend part of their early life stages here. After getting off the boat, our class met at Weeks Bay Visitor Center. We explored the exhibits, both live and, well, not so alive. After we exited along a boardwalk, we encountered many native plants common in wetlands, including the Red Bay, Sweet Bay, which smells amazing, cinnamon fern, American beautyberry, and lots of others. We spent the last part of our day in the pitcher plant bog. Pitcher plants are actually carnivores. Insects are attracted to the plant, fall inside, and enzymes slowly digest them. Our guide opened one up for us, and we saw specimens inside. Glad we already had our lunch. Yuck. Our class ended the hike rescuing wildlife. We spotted a heron entangled by a fishing line, and our classmates, who happened to be with the Florida Park Service, leapt into action and set her free. A good reminder to dispose of microfilaments properly, since they often end up harming wildlife and our environment. Thanks for joining us this week at Weeks Bay National Estuary Research Reserve. Next week, join us while we explore Florida's freshwater spring.